Death Note is a story that is very good at managing strengths and weaknesses, which creates balance. No character is so powerful or effective in the context of the story that they could end the story alone. When characters are given story ending strengths, they are also given major weaknesses. I'll start with Light Yagami. His strengths are obviously his intelligence and the Death Note, but his weaknesses are what makes the story interesting. His first and biggest weakness is his arrogance, confidence, and pride. He killed L's substitute and revealed his location out of pride, which became a massive lead for L's pursuit of Kira. If Light didn't do this, L may have never been able to narrow down Kira's location. Another example would be during L's test. Because he knew the true answer, he looked down on L and showed off his ability to decode the message perfectly, which made him fall into L's trap. Finally, before his death, he was not only overconfident about the confrontation, but even celebrated before he had actually won. Light's second weakness is his desire to see the new world that he creates, which leads to him never using the Shinigami eyes. If he didn't have this trait, he could have wiped out any of his opponents very quickly. Next is Misa Amane. Her strengths are having a Death Note, Shinigami eyes, and a Shinigami who would kill anyone that kills her. The third one prevents Light from simply using her and killing her when he's done. Based on strengths alone, she should be a more competent character than Light, but her weaknesses hold her back. Her first weakness is that she isn't that smart and can be careless. While she can be smart, like how she hid her messages in the Note Blue and Aoyama to meet Kira, the best examples of her carelessness would be her saying the word Shinigami on the tapes and how L found traces of her on the tapes as well, allowing him to deduce that she was the second Kira. Her second weakness is her obsession with meeting Kira. This, along with her first flaw, causes her to initially miss her chance of carrying out Kira's actual will just to meet him. Next is L. His strengths are his intelligence, status, and influence. These allow him to compete with Kira by controlling and navigating the police to a degree, doing things like setting up secret cameras in someone's house and intercepting Kira's tapes. His first weakness would be his lack of a death note. He is forced to deduce the powers of the death note on his own. For example, he was caught off guard by the power of the Shinigami eyes. He also initially fell for Light's added rule because of this weakness. His second weakness is his desire to prove that Light is Kira without killing him. L was almost sure of this fact, but he wouldn't apprehend or kill Light until he could actually prove that he was Kira. If he didn't have this rule, he could easily decide to kill Light and prove that he was Kira afterwards, ending the story quickly. His third weakness is that he's not perfect. The best example would be how Light evaded his wiretappings and cameras. L was able to gain something from it, but it was mostly fruitless. If L was a flawless genius that could see through everything, he would have captured Light a lot earlier. Next is Teru Mikami. His strengths are that he has a death note and knows exactly who Kira would kill and is completely obedient. The second strength particularly contributes to most of the entertaining and smart scenes from part 2. His ability to understand Light so well manifests in his carefulness, but it is also his weakness as it backfired when he broke his scheduled use of the death note due to this, which Nier used to capture Light. His second weakness is his lack of contact with Light. Because of this, Light couldn't tell Mikami that he had already killed Takada, and Mikami took it upon himself to do it, which allowed Nier to switch out the death notes. If he didn't have these weaknesses, he and Light would almost have nothing in their way. Last is Kiyomi Takada. Her strengths are that she can use clippings of the death note, is obedient to Kira and Mikami, and is also a spokesperson for Kira. Mikami and her combined allow Kira to kill many people without Light doing anything. Her last strength is also her weakness. Because she publicly supports Kira, she became a target of suspicion, which leads to Melo capturing her, which then leads to her needing to be killed. All of these characters are strong in Death Note, but they have weaknesses that prevent them from ending the story quickly. What is so creative is how a lot of these flaws are character traits, and how a few of these strengths also function as a weakness. Characters are forced to work around their limits and flaws, which creates amazing scenes and battles. L narrowing down Kira's location, Light finding out a way to get Naomi Misura's real name, and Light using Takada to get in contact with Mikami are just a few spectacular scenes that come from characters working around their weaknesses.